Welcome to a special episode of Shaun of the Sea, a dance in the deep blue, where today's adventure brings us face to face with nature's largest ballet. The Blue Whales. As we glide over the sapphire waters off the coast of San Diego, Sean's drone captures a scene so rare and joyful it feels like a glimpse into a hidden world. Accompanied by Hermione, the ever clumsy but endearing whale whispering dog, today's journey promises to be as enlightening as it is delightful. Giants of the Ocean, marvels of marine magnitude. Imagine an animal whose heart alone is the size of a small SUV, pulsing with a force so strong it sends shockwaves through the ocean depths its tongue weighs as much as a large elephant, powerful enough to shift vast volumes of water. Now, picture a creature whose length rivals that of a commercial airliner. Yes, we're talking about the blue whale, the largest creature ever to have roamed our planet. So immense, in fact, that if you parked three school buses end to end, they would still fall short by a few feet of matching its staggering length. Their sheer scale is beyond what one might encounter in the wildest of fantasies. Yet here they are, real and majestic, flesh and baleen, dancing gracefully through our world's vast oceans. Their bodies, as long as a NASA space shuttle, glide through the water with a serenity that belies their monumental size. A testament to the wonders of evolutionary design. The mouth of a blue whale is so huge that it can take it up to 90 metric tons of water and krill in just one go. To put that into perspective, that's about as much weight as 50 small cars. Imagine this gigantic creature sweeping through the ocean and taking a giant gulp where it could technically hold the weight of 50 cars in its mouth at once. That's how big and powerful it is. As they move through the water, blue whales are like the star performers of the ocean. Their enormous bodies moving with the grace and finesse of a ballet dancer. Each motion is a breathtaking display of nature's incredible craftsmanship. Not only is their mouth capable of holding massive amounts of water, but blue whales also have a unique structure called baleen plates instead of teeth. These plates act like a sieve when the whale takes in water full of small shrimp-like krill. It closes its mouth and pushes the water out through these plates, trapping the krill inside to eat. This fantastic feeding strategy allows them to consume millions of krill every day, necessary for maintaining their massive size and energy. The blue whale's mouth is not only notable for its immense size, but also for its incredible flexibility. When it's time to feed, the lower part of a blue whale's jaw expands dramatically, similar to an accordion stretching to maximum capacity. This remarkable expansion is enabled by specialized pleats under their jaw, which can unfold to accommodate vast quantities of water and krill. Once the whale has engulfed the water, these pleats contract, effectively squeezing the water out while retaining the krill, much like a sponge being wrung out, leaving only the nourishment behind. From the moment a blue whale calf is born, it faces the enormous task of growing into the largest animal on Earth. As a baby, it drinks about 150 gallons of its mother's milk every day. This milk is very rich and fatty, much fattier than human milk helping the calf gain about 200 pounds daily. Imagine having to eat enough to gain that much every single day just to keep up with your growing body. That's the life of a blue whale calf. As they grow into adults, blue whales switch from milk to munching on tiny creatures called krill. Each adult blue whale needs to eat about four tons of krill every day during feeding season to maintain their massive size and energy needs. That's equivalent to the weight of about eight grand pianos made entirely of tiny sea creatures. Imagine your school bus filled not with students, but stacked from floor to ceiling with tiny, shrimp-like krill. A blue whale eats about enough krill to fill up a whole school bus every day. Think about how many rubber duckies could fit in your bathtub at home. Now, instead of rubber duckies, think of krill. A blue whale eats enough krill in one day to fill over 30 bathtubs. If you spread all the krill a blue whale eats in one day across a soccer field, it would cover the field ankle deep. That's a lot of krill and it shows just how much food they need to keep swimming and stay healthy. The blue whale's astonishing size results from millions of years of evolutionary adaptations that allow them to filter a large amount of food with minimal effort, a key to their survival in the vast and food-sparse open ocean. These adaptations include a massive mouth and pleated throat capable of taking in large volumes of water, and a unique method of filtering food using baleen plates. 
The colossal size of these creatures is not just for show, it plays a critical role in their survival. By being so large, they can travel vast distances across the oceans to find enough food to sustain themselves, and their size deters most predators. The evolutionary journey of the blue whale has fine-tuned them to the life in the open waters, where they spend most of their lives. Their growth from calves to adults is a marvel of nature, starting life already as one of the largest creatures on Earth. Blue whale calves undergo rapid growth from the nutrient-rich milk provided by their mothers, which is essential as it provides them with a critical size advantage early in life. This rapid growth continues until they reach their colossal adult proportions, capable of reaching up to 100 feet in length and weighing as much as 200 tons. Understanding this extraordinary growth involves not only observing their diet and behavior, but also studying their genetics and metabolic processes. Research has revealed that specific genes associated with fat metabolism and growth are highly active in blue whales, helping them store energy efficiently and grow quickly. The study of these genetic markers provides insights into how blue whales manage to grow so large and how they maintain their massive body size through efficient feeding strategies. Their solitary nature, punctuated by occasional aggregations in rich feeding grounds, highlights their complex social and feeding behaviors. Despite their size, blue whales are not often seen in large groups, preferring to roam the oceans either alone or in small, loosely connected groups. This behavior is likely an adaptation to their low-density prey and the vastness of their oceanic habitat, requiring them to cover large areas to find enough food to sustain their enormous energy requirements. These insights into the life and evolution of blue whales underscore the importance of protecting these magnificent creatures and the ecosystems they inhabit. Conservation efforts are crucial to ensuring that blue whales continue to thrive in the world's oceans, maintaining the balance of marine ecosystems and allowing future generations to marvel at the largest animals to have ever lived on Earth.